My name is Emily. I am 25 years old. My first time that I gardened was two years ago and uh, I I did one tomato plant that was gifted to me late in the season and then I got like maybe like five little tiny tomatoes by the end of the summer and they were not good. They were really bad tomatoes but <laughs> I loved watching them grow so much. Um, so then I started by seed next year and I did um, four tomato plants. Like when you prune the tomatoes can focus more on the fruit like closer to the end of the season and it helps with like airflow and everything. Um, <laughs> Plucking off the suckers. My little baby. Well, the ones I had last year were really beautiful. They got a little too tall. So then this year I have a really tall line that's been like tied. Uh, so it'll, they can go up to like eight feet this year. I love my, I love my house plants. Um, it all started with uh, one cactus that I named Tim, and he was like the cutest little plump cactus I've ever seen. He's unfortunately dying now, but he inspired all of my other plant shenanigans. But I've always had the one with me, which is uh, a Hoya plant that my dad gave me. And it's actually a cute story. Uh, when he was in university, his grandmother gave him a cutting from her plant and he got that when he moved into residence. And then when I moved into residence, he gave me a cutting from his plant mm -hmm. as well. And it's cute because we went to the same university and we moved in the same residence. It was very full circle. I love my house plants. I like watching them grow. I'm growing uh, cherry tomatoes. like. A regular tomato and then a beefsteak variety that's called I think Big Rainbow that comes out in like multicolored beans on an arbor and I'm growing kale and lettuce and beets and zucchini, cucumber, herbs, several herbs including chives, tarragon, dill, basil, cilantro and parsley, sage, and some edible flowers. When I was a kid, we used to go strawberry um, picking and then we'd bring them back and freeze them, put them in baggies in the freezer all winter and we would make uh, like a strawberry syrup for our waffles. And I loved it. It was the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. I love strawberry so much I even got it tattooed. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm growing strawberries, I love strawberries.